thinking, you know, um, all human being in, in, in United States and around the world who see suffering and pain of Gaza, who uh, witnessed through the videos, pictures, TV programs, the destruction and the, uh, and, and, and the pain and suffering of the people of Gaza, uh, first things they can do, whatever their belief is, whatever the way they are thinking, make prayers for people of Gaza. Because such pain and such suffering is not very easy to endure. It is very, very heavy on the heart and mind of the, of the, of the people. So when we say people, people of you know, every faith and, and, and everybody who suffers, our prayers should be for them. Second, a organization, you don't need to do all through the Zakat Foundation, but you believe that organization that really doing the work in, in Gaza, so do your best, contribute whatever you can. So bear the share of yours as a human being living in this uh, planet. The third, uh, identify projects and programs that are really closer to your heart. Like if you are sponsoring an orphan, maybe sponsor second orphans. If you're sponsoring two orphans, maybe sponsor an orphanage to bring these services to families, you know, take the burden of, the, of the raising the children from the single moms, children of single moms, help them to raise these children by providing comprehensive and holistic approach the, the raising the children. And also support the programs and projects that helping to heal those who are injured, lost their part of their bodies and everything else, so that uh, they have uh, ability uh, to provide their families or to, to live in, these, in this world in Gaza in a dignified way rather than asking other people's help. And we help them to, 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 to be able to stand on their, on their feet uh, financially and otherwise it will be probably best things that we can do for Gaza and for people of Gaza.